Hi. Uh, you ever tried to work the, the law of attraction uh, or or the secret to work for you and you're finding that it's, it's taking a long time to get the results that you want? Well, I have a two-second two second technique that uh, automatically works. It's hardwired in your brain to work for you. And it's in my book, uh, No Pain, Only Gain, How to Become a Trillionaire. And I'm going to share with you the question. It's in the book right now. And so that, will help, so that you can get what you want. And first, let me explain why the question works for you. When, we're, when we have something negative happen in our life, whether it's, you know, we didn't get the pay raise or, or we had to take a job that didn't pay us what we want, we don't like our boss, or we, our spouse has given us trouble, you know, we have the evidence right then, right there. It's like, of course I feel sad. I chose to be sad because I have the evidence that's, that's, it led me, the evidence led me to this feeling that I have. And so when we try to have a positive thought, you know, from the law of attraction or, the, you know, uh, from the secret, at that moment in our, our brain goes, no, that's not true. And it will not allow that in. And so if you go in front of the mirror and you say, I am rich or I am happy, it goes clunk inside of you. And you don't feel that. And in fact, you may be even lower than you were before because it's like, oh my gosh, I can't get out of this poverty. I can't get out, right? I'm stuck. And so it just drives you further and further into that. And now you have more evidence. So how do you get out of that? How do you go from negative to positive? Well, you go, you make a stop at neutrality. And how do you get to neutrality? You put your brain in a search mode. That's how it's hardwired. So you ask yourself a question, a specifically worded question. It's in my book. Why do I love discovering what's between me and loving kindness? And I usually ask myself that question twice. The first time I'm focusing on discovering because that puts me in the search mode, puts me in neutrality. And for that moment, I'm not thinking about the thing that was bothering me. You know, for me, I have a broken back, so if I drop something on the floor, i got to go get the grabber. It takes me about 10 times as long to pick something up as it would a normal person. So, so that first time, it's like, wh why do I love discovering? I'm already in neutrality. And then the second time, it's like, why do I love? Why do I love discovering what's between me and loving kindness? Right? And love is a gratitude word. And gratitude, by law, gives you grace. And grace is the land of miracles. I can't tell you how many miracles I have. I have them many times a day. I'll get insights, ideas, how to live my life, different ways of doing things, inventions, like I, I invented, uh, where is it? I don't know where I put it. The Whirling Bliss Machine. You'll just have to go to the website. And uh, I'm going to point to it right over, you see it's right there. You know, I'm pointing to where I believe it's supposed to be or maybe below the screen, wherever you find it. Um, and I have links to all these different things. You can find out more about them. But anyway, so inventions come to me and and ideas. And it's so it's amazing how things can shift. I had somebody who's never talked to me. I mean, excuse me. They had never, we've never met. She sent me $2,000 because she likes what I'm doing. All right, so this can happen when you're in the land of miracles. And those kind of miracles give you energy. And energy is something to be grateful about. So now we've got energy that starts with an E. Gratitude is G. Grace is G. Egg. A zero calorie egg, that one is. And you can have as many of those eggs as you want. And so that's the way your life goes. And then, by the way, in my book, I also described for you, you know, you've probably heard the expression that what you believe, comma, in your heart, you can become. Well, for the longest time, I, you know, I had a hard time relating to that because, I, you know, I, I, I believed it intellectually. It was told to me as being true and sounded right, but I couldn't make it work. Well, this book describes how to make it a thousand trillion 
trillion, trillion times more believable. And I didn't pick that number out of a hat. That's an actual number, and it's described in the book uh, how I arrived at that number. I didn't arrive at it, someone else did, and, uh, and I use it in a, in a different way. So you're going to be able to have that believability factor so that when you go through the process of why do I love discovering what's between me and loving kindness, and those miracles show up, you're going you're gonna to believe. And what you believe in your heart, you can become. And it's just so awesome. So awesome. You know, it used to be when I was in the store, or I'd be anywhere, people wouldn't look at me so much, and particularly women. You know, they would take one quick look and they'd look away, not making any more eye contact with me at all. Now, I can be in the, in the wide uh, space, you know, the, of the uh, parking lot at Publix. It's a grocery store here in, in Florida, Panama City. And people will be across the way, and they will look over and smile like, and say hi to me. Just like that. They, they, they want to talk to me. And it's really, you know, it's a very nice feeling to go through life that way. You know, I have so much, so much uh, love going on back and forth. So, um, go check out the link, and where is it now? It's uh, right there, I believe, or below the screen, and 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 then you can check, maybe if you want, you can check out the book or the other things I've talked about. Um, and I hope to see you on the other side. Will you take care and God bless? Now, where is that button that you got to click to say goodbye?